All right, happy birthday, Nicanor Parra. 100 years old yesterday. We are celebrating today at Malvern Books. Yay! Yay! And I'm going to start by reading Pablo Neruda. Okay, does that make sense? Yes, because Pablo Neruda is from Chile. And uh, he's a great poet, won the Nobel Prize, and we are celebrating, beginning the celebration of Nicanor Parra by reading of Ode to the Dog, translated by George Shade. The dog asks me, and I have no answer. He jumps, scampers through the fields, and wordlessly asks me, and his eyes are two quiet question marks, two liquid interrogating flames, and I've no answer, no answer because I don't know, I just can't. Cross country we go, man and dog. The leaves glisten as if someone had kissed them one by one. All the oranges climb from the ground to establish little planetariums in the trees round as the night, and green and man and dog we go. Sniffing the world, parting the clover through the fields of Chile, between September's clear fingers. The dog comes to a halt, chases after bees, leaps over gushing brooks, perks up his ears at far off barking, urinates on a rock, and brings me the point of his nose like a gift. It's, hot. it's his tender coolness, conveying his tenderness, and there he asked me with his two eyes why it's daytime. Why night comes? Why spring brought nothing in its basket for roaming dogs, but useless flowers, 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 flowers. And so the dog asks, and I have no answer. We go, man and dog together through the green morning, the rousing empty solitude where only we exist. This unity of dew and dog and poet of the forest. For the hidden bird does not exist, nor the secret flower, just trill and fragrance for the two companions, the two hunting companions, a world humid with the essence of night, a green tunnel, and then a meadow, a whiff of orange scented air, the rustle of roots, life walking, breathing, growing, and the age-old friendship, the joy of being man and dog, converted into a single animal, walking along, moving, six legs and a tail, splashed with dew. <laughs>